In this video, I'm going to take you through the possibilities on your customer portal in Buildertrend, as well as show you the mobile application. Please keep in mind while we go over these features, highlight all of the possibilities you have. If you have been invited to participate with your builder via email, you will be able to set up your own username and password. Some builders will create a username and password for you, so please feel free to log into Buildertrend once you have your credentials. To log into Buildertrend, please use the login box located on your builder's website. You have quick access to a week view of your schedule at the bottom and are one click away from viewing the entire schedule. On the right side of your screen, you have access to a dashboard which will keep you in the loop as to what's happening with your job. From here, you can quickly see any items that have been added for you to view, as well as take action. You can click the links to go directly to that specific feature. Beneath your What's Happening dashboard, you can see the weather report for your zip or postal code, as well as see your most recent comments. When utilizing your menu at the top, moving on to the scheduling feature, this is where you can go to see an up-to-date schedule of where your job is and what's coming. You can view this information as a schedule view, list view, or Gantt view. And by clicking on the schedule item, you will have the ability to leave a comment on the schedule item, which will notify your builder, keeping all communication organized within Builder Trend. From the schedule view, you can see any change order deadlines, selection deadlines, as well as any to-do deadlines that have been assigned to you. For progress reports from your builder, please click your daily logs feature at the top of your screen. From here, you will be able to see all daily logs that your builder has shared with you. These will be easy to understand progress reports and will alleviate any additional email and or phone calls that would normally occur. As always, if you had a question, please feel free to use that commenting feature and leave a comment on the daily log itself. From the Documents tab at the top, you can access any documents that your builder has shared. To view the document, please click on the folder, then the document that you would like to view. You do have the ability to upload any of your own documents, but they will need to be uploaded into the Owner Uploaded Files folder. If you go into this folder, you can click the Add Documents button, which will take you to our uploader, where you can drag and drop documents in, or simply search your computer. When the documents have been added, click Upload in the bottom right to complete this process. For videos, you can access any progress videos that have been shared with you. The workflow is similar to viewing documents. The Photos feature will be a place of reference as to see what's going on with the job. You can easily click into Folders, as well as View Photos, and even add your own photos to the appropriate folder using the same workflow as uploading documents. The Messages section is where you can easily message your builder, similar to an email. All messages will be logged within this feature for your reference. You can send a message by clicking the Compose New Message option and select the particular individual you're wanting to send the message to. You can send a message to an external party by clicking the plus icon next to the To drop down. The commenting feature itself will be a great point of reference to view all comments made throughout Builder Trend. You will typically be in an actual feature when adding comments. Comments are similar to text messages, except these are logged within Builder Trend as to have a nice, neat, organized historical record of all correspondence. Within your change order feature, you can formally request a change order by clicking the New Change Order button. This is an item that was not outlined in your original contract with the builder and will now be handled as a change order. Change orders that you request, or change orders that your builder enters into the program for you, can be accessed within this feature for your management, review, and final approval. If your builder is set up for online payments, you can easily pay your builder through Builder Trend. Setup is quick and easy and will streamline this process. Your selections feature at the top is where you can access different options that your builder has set up for the job. You can favorite choices as you go by clicking the star icon. This will allow you to reference all of your favorites at the top. You can outright approve all of your favorites in mass at this point or click the green approval check mark on your choices. This will allow you to approve choices one at a time. Once you sign off, 
the selection will have officially been approved and this will notify your builder. To submit a warranty claim, please navigate to your warranty tab at the top. You can submit a new warranty claim by clicking the green New Claim button here at the top. You can title the claim, as well as categorize what your issue is with. Please enter as much information into the description field as possible, as it will help your builder address the issue. You can add attachments and comment on the warranty as well. Your builder may be sending surveys to you, and you can easily access those from your Surveys tab at the top, fill out the appropriate information, and submit that back to the builder at any time. Within your Invoices tab, you are able to see all of your past as well as your present invoices from your builder. This does include change orders, and again, if they are set up with online payments, you can easily pay any invoice through BuilderTrend. If your builder is doing more than one job for you, you will have the ability to toggle between your different jobs in order to see the information for each. You will only need one username and password to log in, and this will allow you to access all of your jobs that you are doing with this builder. From the gear icon in the top right, if you select Setup, here is where you can edit your login information, as well as upload a display photo to your account, and even enter a phone number to receive text message notifications. You are able to set up guest accounts in this part of the program as well. Doing this will allow you to invite anyone into your customer portal to check in on your project. The difference between your login and a guest login is that the guest login will not have access to any financial information, nor will they be able to legally approve anything. Their credential will be your user ID and whatever password you create for them. You can download the BuilderTrend mobile application from the App Store if using an Apple device, or the Google Play Store if using an Android device. This will allow you to see your job information on the go. You can easily log in with your own credentials and have immediate access to all of your information to approve items, comment, etc. The features and functionality on the mobile application are the exact same as on your computer, so please feel free to browse your job information while you're on the go. If you do have any questions regarding the functionality of BuilderTrend, please let us know, as we're always happy to help.